Today, um, we're going to talk about the diseases and insects that are on the uh, 4-H Alabama State Forestry List. Uh, I'm Scott Ennebeck, a professor of forest pathology at School of Forestry at uh, Auburn University. And we're going to do them group-wise. And the first group we have here is Fomes anosis. Fomes anosis is a root decay organism found uh, throughout the southern United States. And these are its fruiting bodies that you find. Typically, you'll find them at the base of a tree, along the stumps, along the roots. They're a very messy fungus or fruiting body. And by what I mean that is they always seem to have the leaves and the litter layer associated with it. The other thing that's uh, interesting with this particular one, it, the top will be brown, or brown with it have a white margin. Brown with the white margin. All of these are brown with the white margin. They have the litter layer. If you turn it over, it'll be white. It'll have a white layer. If you look really closely with the hand lens, you'll see it has pores. Here's another one. The top, it's got a brown top, white margin. It's got the pores, and it's kind of what I would say gnarly, or maybe looks like an ear. All of these, you turn them over, have a white bottom. And you can differentiate this from the other fungi we'll talk about later. Here's again, white bottom. This is foamy zoonosis. Now another symptom of foamy zoonosis is the kind of decay it causes. And it causes a white, stringy rot. And here's a piece of root that I dug up from a tree. And what happens is the fungus decays the wood system, and it comes apart like string cheese, although it's too dry for too bad. So it pulls apart. It's white and stringy. So this is foamy zoonosis. It's got a brown top. It usually has litter layer associated with it, leaves. It's got a white margin, and the underneath will be white, but it'll be bumpy and uh, uh, not flat. And we'll talk about the flat one later.